Hey guys, John Lux here back with our new blind playthrough. This is Tiny and Big Grandpa's Leftovers. Um, it's an indie game. It was released back in 2012 for 10 bucks, I think. And uh, I think I got it as part of like a Humble Bundle or something because I've, I've never played it and I've always been kind of wondering what it is. Strangely, it looks a lot like Borderlands. It has that, uh, you know, pencil art style. But I think it's actually supposed to be more of a, a third-person puzzle platformer, action platformer, or something like that. So we'll see. You're you're this dude. You're tiny, who's a inventor, and he uses different gadgets. I think to maybe shape the environment. So we shall see. That's about all I know. Let's jump in. With me today's Jack. He's in the lap. Uh, Grandpa's. We're on our quest to find Grandpa's underpants. Basically, if that wasn't clear. So, get the pants. There we go. I don't know why that's like that. So, I did do a little thing, uh, just a little test recording. Let's do new game. See, that's me and Gramps. And he's wearing the underpants on his head. So, yeah. Uh -huh. I sense adventure is near. Isn't it time to put away that silly toy and gear for action? What do you think I'm doing here? Playing this better than life laser simulation on my reality boy prepares me perfectly for any real life obstacles to come. See? So I assume this is like a training thing or intro mission or something. Alright, welcome to better than life laser simulation on your reality boy. So my test recording, I basically just beat this. This one little section right here. I got the little underpants there. Look around near the mouse or the right thumbstick. Do you see the pants? Walk with WASD or left stick and try to reach them. Hmm, I know. I know. Yawning already. Oh wow, I never realized there was all that stuff up there. I wonder if that's more of, like, later levels or something. Use A to jump. He's adorable. Oh, even blinks and everything. That's nice. Are you going somewhere, Jack? You gonna steal the heated cat bed now that your brother's in the closet? All right. Well done. The virtual pants are yours. Laser games for nerds. Is that what that said? And this is where I stopped, my little test recording. So hopefully the sound is all good. It looked fine. My test recording, it sounded fine. Hopefully everything goes well. That is all. All right, let's do this. Push the cubes to get your way to the pants. Right, because you can't jump. Oh. Interesting. So it doesn't quite doesn't quite, like, line up with the grid. Oh, can I push this big one? Oh, let's see if you're strong enough for this one. Oh, see, it's like... What? What was that? So it's, like, physics-based. Interesting. Good tips for Reality Boy. You, don't, you got your claw for this level. Let's figure out how to use it. All right. Claw. Pull. Aim at the box, push and hold B to grab it, walk backwards to pull. Ah. Okay. Neat. I, I gotta be honest, I love all the little retro effects. I wonder how much of that like, is nostalgia. Uh, yeah, that should be good. That should work. All right, use your claw skills. Wow, yeah, it's getting more complicated. Okay, so where... I guess we can run through there. That's good. 
so we need to get presumably onto this. Can we just... Oh, interesting. <laughs> Alright, so that's there. I wonder what the range on that is. But yeah, there, there are times that I do miss the Game Boy. I don't know why. Like I said, maybe it's nostalgia, you know, a time when things were a lot simpler and easier. You didn't have to worry about... Interesting. Okay, that works. Didn't have to worry about taxes or... You know, making sure you had enough hours in your job. This one was a bit harder, but you did pretty well. You got your laser now. Push and hold left mouse to draw a cutting line. Make sure the line covers the whole stone. Release the button and enjoy. Oh, can we not use the controller for this one? Find nice position and happy cutting. Ah, oh, okay, so that's trigger. And then what, release it? Can't cut this. Cool. So... Hmm. Do we try that? Our little... Yeah, okay. And then maybe we... Can I not... Why can I not pull? Uh, no. How do I... Hmm. Ah, oh, interesting. Okay. Huh. That's different than I expected. Cut wisely. You can't undo your cuts. Yeah, I figured that one out. If you want to interrupt the cutting, press LMB again. Oh, hang on. Oh, I guess I just... You have to create a line by moving the cursor. Yeah, so I'm using the controller. It's left trigger. You selected nothing to pull. Can't pull this. Oh, I could use the triggers instead of the... Oh, well, that's neat. Laser battery. Great storage unit for high space age performance from the local pawn shop. Powers your tools laser. A truly genuine battery. Don't lose it again. Oh, neat. It's a little thing. Hold LB, draw a cutting line, cover the whole object, release to cut. Yep, fair enough. Sticky claw. Laser pieces must be pulled. This self-built self grappling claw allows you to easily, easily move heavy things around to make your way. Comes with a rope o steel and is shot from the tool. Aim at a movable piece. Push and hold B button, walk backwards. Nice pulling. The tool. It's the tool. Crafted by yourself. It's got everything in the environment lumber needs. Including a laser, rope device, and rocket slot. Batteries not included. Color blue. Music to cut rocks by tinyandbig.com slash soundtrack. Interesting. Oh, yeah, they did. I think they did mention the soundtrack on this, so I'm probably going to get copyright claimed. Oh, well. Uh, safety goggles. These ones protect your eyes from flying rock and pebble dust. Checkered version. Reality boy. As a fancier... Of video gaming, you carry your latest and best companion in mobile entertainment, the Reality Boy. It gives you access to a tremendous load of games, retro style. A good time waster to go. The Radio. It's the Radio, your self-built friend and companion ever since you were a child. You constructed it yourself and steadily enhanced its features. This model can even play music and has a soul of its own. Radio on, off, current button left. Skip through your tapes, current button right. Get a hint, current button up. I don't know what these empty things are. These are probably all tapes, because it talked about collecting the soundtrack. Uh, that looks like a spider thing. Oh, I see. Tape with music. Mr. No One, Retro Blues. Got it. 
All right, so we only have so many cuts. Well, I would I would probably say we want to cut like from here kind of all the way down or or across like this, right? Can we cut two things at once? Maybe. Oh, huh, I wonder, well, let's, re oh, well, no, releasing it releases the laser, so, hmm, maybe that'll work. Okay, we can use, oh, oh, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> I'm like moving the stick around. Maybe I shouldn't do that. B is fine. Okay, so that's A's jump. What's... You have to create a line. Okay, so the left trigger and button are both that. I have to find my rocket first. What happens if it hits me? Now we know. <laughs> okay. How far can I cut from? Here, maybe? Woo, all right. Right, so don't let the blocks fall on you. All right, now you got your rocket. Aim in the box, push middle mouse button, which I hate. Push and hold again to ignite. Rocketize those cubes. Oh, that's kind of neat. It, it push, it just pushes them. It doesn't. That's funny. I figured it would, like, blow them up, but it... But it doesn't. That's neat. Great. As with every video game, this simulation prepared you perfectly for your challenges in the real world. That's funny. Now stop playing and catch big. Save your family's honor. Team unlocked old schooler. Damn it, the batteries are dead. Just in time, our adventure draws near. Really? What? Whoa! Okay. Small stones will crumble when sliced. Ah. Huh. Press a key. The bowl of trying. Hmm. Thief. Oh, that must be big. Yikes. What happened? Something hit us. I nearly got killed. Lost my whole equipment. And where the heck are we? I will guide you. Come pick me up. Alright, we need to leave this place and find Big. Let's go. Alright. I have to find my tools first. Voodoo Trombone Quartet Cold Reader. Push that stone, climb to collect the rest of your tools. Enjoy the built-in music track. If you want to search the song, press right. Like to God forbid, turn it off. Press left. Eh, this is fine. Push. Oh. So we can probably change and cut maybe everything in the environment. Great, you got the tool. Pull. 
You remember how to use rope, don't you? Otherwise, press Y to read the manual. Yay. Why am I pulling these things? Fuck. Well done. Yay. All right, well, probably pull on that one, maybe. Up there is your laser, get it. Well, it's a battery, at least. You got the genuine battery. Want to practice? Cut that cactus. Remember how to use your laser. I'll cut this cactus. Nice. Smash them with rocks to practice cutting. Smash them, are you sure? Don't worry, the desert is full of them. Mostly harmless, unless you catch them on a bad day. Once they had infested my basement, it took me weeks to smush them all. All right. I think... Oh. Oh, those? Yeah, okay. Bravo, you squished one. Never mind, the desert is full of them. Does it not slide? Cool. Oh, it's repeating already? Bravo! All right. In front of you is another music tape. I see it. Oh, I see. Tape with music. Onda bebon mia bores ko kada ves something. The text is actually going really fast. Is there no text speed option? Well, all right then. Do I have to smush all these things? Works for me. Something's glowing over there. That's your rocket. Well, let's get it. Boom. You found your handmade rocket. Ah. Yep, read the manual if you can't remember how. That is pretty cool. I wonder if you can get on it and like... No. Uh, fail too short, but it's a tough one. Oh, I didn't know I was aiming for that, but that's fine. Let's try it again. Turn, turn, there we, there we go, maybe. Ah, oh, too far. Too far, but still well done, that's funny. All right, well, what is this thing? Can I cut it? Huh. All right.
This is interesting. Can I? I'm trying to trying to turn it. I'm trying to. I want to launch this thing. If I if I can. Hmm. Oh. Yeah. Just gotta just gotta watch out. Ah oh, man. Come on, dude. Up up the up the ramp. Ah oh, man. Well. Let's try this. Maybe we could do this. Uh I mean, you know, pretty close. Alright, we're seeing a lot of exits in my day. And that surely looks like one. Shouldn't be too hard to get up there. Uh. Oh, I see. Yeah, I want you to cut the rock like that. Lever. Well. Smyrtle. Oh, and you can kind of pull both. Just gotta be careful. Just have to be really careful. And there's the taxi. Or the car. What's the... Uh, I'm sorry. Taxi robo. Oh no, now I'll lose my license. Oh, that wasn't ours. Alright, fair enough. Oh, so there was a little robot or something. Okay. Well. That's fair, I guess. I mean, you know, sucks. What is this? A boring stone, one of four. Stone collector. All right. Whoa, excuse me. So, I suppose that's where I have to go. Quite a nice view. Quite elevated. How the heck shall I get down to that bridge, huh? Maybe I might help you? Oh, it's big. He's wearing the underpants on his head. Oh, but he's not big. Achievement locked invisible, invincible pupil. I'm tiny, he's big. It's, yeah, okay. Wait, stones. One of four tapes. One of two cuts. Eleven of two. Deaths, zero. Steam leaderboard, I guess. Uh, oh, to retry a section from the last checkpoint. From altitude on upwards. Well, where was the other tape? The radio. Oh, wow. Cool transition. Yikes, I nearly got killed. Again. That was big, right? It was. Kicked your ass pretty hard, didn't he? If you can climb up that mountain, you might get the chance to pay him back. Alright. Well. Uh, huh. I see. I want to find the other tape, though. Load level, yeah. Press N to skip through your tape collection. Ah. Uh. Oh, man. Let's go. Got the tool. Okay, got that. Hmm. There's something up there, I think. And I wonder about some of those as well.
What do I do with these? Am I supposed to smash them? Oh, okay, we can't do anything with that. Can I push this? Kind of. Seems like pulling might be faster and easier, but... Wait, can I even jump on it? Yeah, okay. Try not to use the cuts. It's not super important, but it said two. All right, tape with music. Oh, but they do come back. Hmm. Is there a point to launching this thing? Oh, I can't. I have to find my rocket first. Cool, got the rocket. What? I don't know why it tilted, but anyway. Alright, so that's the exit. Yep, I get that. Uh, I have to create a line. Right. Alright, cool. Cool beans. Now let's figure out what that is up there. I bet... I bet hitting that thing with the rocket gives you something else. You know? I think pulling all these off does something. I don't know. Oh, what about the big one? No, I can't. Nothing to pull. Okay, this you can, though. Oh, it's tilting. Hmm. Okay, well, I am... Hmm, strange. Things big. See, this looks like something too. Ah, gotta be wow. Yeah, gotta be careful of that. Destruction. All right, well, let's. I want to try getting up there at least. Huh. Well, now what? Ooh. 
Well. Okay, I mean, that's something. What are the odds this is another stone instead of a tape? Hi. A boring stone. Well, hello. Eek. God of trying. I don't know what the- I did? What for? Looking at it with face? Scientists think they depict the almighty gods who built the universe. Creepy. I don't like the idea they might be watching us. Ah, So... Is there something up there, then? Because I see platforms, but I... I mean, I can't get up there, though. Okay, well... All right, well, whatever. Oh, wait, is that... Is there something up there? Can I fall to my death? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right, you can fall to your death. How far can you fall? Unknown. Oh no, that's that's the exit. Oh, there's something up there though. Okay, how do I get up there? Looks like it goes around. And that's probably another stone. Kind of a rocket, yeah. So, can I rocket this thing? Looks like no. Can I grab it? It does move a little. It wiggles just a bit. Huh. But it's probably too big. something. Okay. All right. Ah, uh, come on. Still too big. I mean, even if we get up there, I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to get up to the top there. You know what I mean? That's pretty high. Maybe that did something. Maybe that helped a little bit.
That's fine. Um, hmm. I, I know, I know I want to create a line, but maybe I could do it like this. Just gotta try not to get smushed. That's actually not bad. Uh, hmm. Is that where I'm trying to go? Over that way? Well... cut up here. I don't know. Can I pull this to me? No. Okay, so you can't cut the edge of the stage. I mean, that makes sense. Yeah, this is a... Uh, it's hard getting some of these things. Because I'm like... Do I... Huh, maybe I... That might have been a bad idea. Maybe it kind of worked. I don't know, we'll try cutting this. Uh... Oh, well that... Kind of. Alright. Mm-hmm. This is a bad idea. Okay, well... So that went way... <laughs> um, way farther than I expected it to, to be honest. Cut another little bit off the top. A little bit off the top. Still not working what how I need it to work though. You have to cover the whole object. I know I'm trying. Let's try like like this. That didn't work, son of a biscuit. Oh. Come on, man. Do I have to do all that cutting again? I'm sure I do, because it's like, oh, from the last thing that you picked up. So I'm just like, ah, let's go. Let's go. Where am I going? This way. Yes, it's all... It's all pristine. 
you really gotta be careful, actually, because falling is your big... Falling's your big thing. Can I skip this? Uh... Yeah, okay. I guess so. I hit start. A little disappointing. A little disappointing. I was like, let me get... How are we doing on time? Time is okay. Okay. I'm not really... huge on puzzle games. Being someone looking for pants, this seems to be the right place. Whoever built this probably had some minor obsession, don't you think? Oh! Wow, yeah, look at that. Look at all these underpants figurines. A tape with music. cro band Lusitania. Alright, well, we have to go up, right? Uh, hmm. Create a line. I know. I know this. One of twenty-one. F that. Oh, even the even the light coming through the ceiling is. That's funny. All right, well, where... Is this really what we're supposed to do? We're supposed to climb up the inside of this thing? I'm probably... No. No, thankfully, no. Looks like no. Okay. Oh. Because I was like, seriously, if I have to do that crap, I'm... Maybe just gonna quit. <laughs> you know? Okay, so I can... Yeah, sometimes pushing is easier. Good music, though. Ah, oh, man, my jumps are a little too... There we go. <sighs> really? Is, is that where we're supposed to go? goes into nothingness, of course. So... <sighs> what the hell am I supposed to do here? Fantastic. Can't pull this. Yeah, I don't... Wait, is this... Oh. What's happening? need a little piece. There we go. 
Yeah, for a sec I was I was like, man, I'm gonna give up. <laughs> you know. Huh, okay, well. So if I cut this way it slides, right? Just the... There we go. Whoa, doggy. All right. And then... How high am I supposed to keep going up? Ooh. Almost fell. That's no good. Oh. Yeah, they're, they're gone. They're gone forever. And then, uh, I guess you just keep going up. Is that the point? What's on the other side of this? Hopefully that's good. Uh, huh. Is this the main chamber? Yeah. Still have a ways to go, but let's hope we can get up to the top. Oh. Super nervous about heights. But maybe these, uh, these stones lead the way? Yeah. Okay, cool. Uh oh, watch out. <laughs> ah, that's where you're hiding. Yep, here I am. Why did you throw this stone at me? Because I can. Wow. Let's move on up inside these ruins. Yep. See, what is this? I don't know, but... I would guess we want to make this fall or something. We can't push it, right? No, okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Timber! Well, that's kind of... That kind of works. Hey, it works. All right. What is this? I don't know, but it's a door. There's like, I don't know. Is it a door or a person or, I don't know. All right, what do we got here? Probably, it's very physics based, which could be good, but could also be, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be straight up. I When we walked into that first thing and it was just the four columns and just straight up, I was like, and I didn't, you know, I didn't know there was that other door on the side. I was like, I don't think I'm going to play this game. I, I'm like, I don't think I can. That's too much slicing these columns. Like, you know what I mean? What do I, uh, hmm. Because I probably... And then it falls, right? Yeah. 
you go too low and you smack your head on the thing. All right, which, well, not this way, that's for sure. So that way. Problem is I don't want to just launch these things off the, off the platform because what if I need them, you know what I mean? Okay, see, this explains why there are all these stones all over. Right. I think there's something past, though. Alright, probably go in there. There's something else. Don't fall. Uh, huh, am I supposed to just keep going this way? Maybe so. Let's take a peek in here first. Huh. There's something over there. Let's see if we can... Lightning or power or, or something. Oh, all right, never mind. These are all blocked off. So we do have to keep going. That's fine. I assume those stones are like a little checkpoint. Um, what is past? Took a risk right there. Anything past here? No. Something else. Um, oh, hello. Well, that's probably what you're supposed to do, yeah. Well, Interesting, so those are something as well. Like those are physics based as well, I mean. That's fine. Don't fall through. Right. Gotta do that again, I would assume. That's physics. That's physics for you. Um. Can I do something stupid like... I really tried. I was trying to push it forward so that when it fell it would hit and, and fall. Um, okay. Well. is good. That makes me happy, at least. Well, how do I... Hmm. Don't. Don't. Okay, well. See, that time. Yes. Yeah, 
partially luck, partially skill, I suppose. Uh huh. So I think I have to go back this way. Maybe. Or maybe not. Or maybe we do, because there's more stones over there, right? What's over this way? That way is nothing. Man. I do not like heights. <laughs> I don't like heights. I don't really care for puzzles, if I'm being honest. I, I used to. I actually used to like puzzles a lot, but now it just feels like I'm wasting my time. You know what I mean? It's like, what? Wait. Is there something past this? What do I do? What do I do here? And I think, I think that is part of it, that is... See, I'm a fabulous dentist. That's funny. We are not here to enjoy the view. Fabulous dentist. Don't forget about the pants. Uh, okay. We are pretty close, I think. Is this the top, technically, and oh, there's the pants. I mean, sort of. Is it gonna be some weird, like, holy artifact? How do I get up on it? Do I need to get onto this thing? And maybe not. Uh, or maybe I do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Man, I am so tense. Oh god. What, I have to slice his nostril now too? No? Okay, what about this? What about that way? No. Can I... Is, is that where I'm supposed to go, though? Huh, maybe, maybe so. Okay, no. What, uh... I didn't, uh... I didn't expect that, actually. Look, there he is. Give me back my pants, rude-ass kicker. <laughs> Where are these insults from? Oh man, I gotta stop. No way, the pants are mine, but I brought you something else. Eh? Well, maybe he can break the floor, but he can't kick you from over there, can he? So move and kick him back. Cut him down from the pillar. Oh. Oh, well. Whoa. Is this the end? I hope this is the end. 
mysterious earthquake. Big again. End of the world. There goes something. Cool. Oh, and that must show our achievements for this level or something. The horrible moment. Big will flee if he becomes unbalanced. The radio says. Uh, again? You have quite a talent in nearly getting killed. The ceiling collapsing. Was that big? I don't know, but I have a bad feeling. Something weird is going on. Whatever it is, this old desert temple is definitely the first place I would go to investigate. Let's go. Why do I hear monkeys? Oh, it's one of those guys. You think there's an achievement for, like, squishing every single one? Well, main menu. Yes. Hopefully it's saved. I think it did. All right, guys. Well, that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. Really do appreciate it. Really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. Um, yeah, this game is actually super stressful, which is weird. I, I don't know why. Maybe it's my fear of heights getting in, but, um, but yeah. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for your time and attention. I really hope you guys are enjoying this. Um, if, if you're not, if you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. Uh, what is your guys' unique positive moment for today? It's something I like to do at the end of every episode that uh, basically reframes your mind because it trains you to seek the positive when everything is so negative in the world. All the news, everything, it just forces your perspective into the negative. And so you have to focus on the positive and that makes it a little bit more, more neutral. There's more science behind it, but, um, you know, even when I explain it, it's still just paraphrased. But what is your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, I'm going to say um, not giving up on the game. Because when I first had that initial thing, I was like, I have to slice all these pillars and figure out a way to ladder them and get to those platforms way up there. I'm like, nah, I'm not going to do that. Uh, and then I'm like, oh, wait, what about this door over here? So it, it kind of freaked me out for a little bit but then uh but then i'm like all right maybe that's maybe there is something here so is that kitty the, the i don't think it's my screen that looks dirty there's like a there's like a a filter on it or something um but like i said that's my unique puzzle moment hopefully your guys are just as good if not better hopefully better of course and i hope to see you guys next time till then guys take care